Hello there, dear viewer. And now it's the, the start of the new year, 2023. And I am thinking about stuff, um, planning uh, the future of my channel and the like. And I will be talking to you about that for a few minutes. And there will be some uh, Fallout 4 footage of me slaughtering some ghouls or muties or whatever. It's not really relevant to what I'm talking about. So I have crossed the 3000 subscribers mark uh, recently and that's satisfying. Although, well, nobody ever says that, uh, what I'm about to say. Nobody ever admits it. Uh, and maybe there's a good reason. I, I am going to say it anyway. I expected a bit more when I started this, a bit of an easier ride. And it's not to say that I am, you know, ungrateful or that I am and I want to be a PewDiePie, another PewDiePie. It just it's it's a slog at times. It's it's it can be frustrating, while it can also be very rewarding and satisfying. So I guess the best the best approach is not to think too much about the numbers, but on the other hand you sort of have to think about the numbers because they do and indicate that you are making progress. Maybe you are getting better and there is no uh, there is not much in terms of better a better indication. So, of course, mm, as I still would like to try some new things, you know, new types of content and a new approach to the old uh, type of content, old and regular for this channel at least, so mainly Skyrim builds, as you probably know. So, yeah, I will try that. And uh, that will require some time. So, first and foremost, well, yeah, it's two minutes and I'm only just starting to actually say the things I want to say. It's not the best YouTube video. No, not really. But anyway, I, what I'm trying to say is I am going on a little break, a hiatus of sorts. Now, it doesn't mean that there won't be any uploads. There will be, in fact, a build in, uh, uh, two, in two weeks time, maybe, or one week soon-ish there will be a, uh, a build and uh, it's a very interesting one and uh, possibly there will be some other videos scattered here and there but I expect now I'm not promising anything I expect to be back to a more regular pattern and schedule of uploading sometime uh, Febru in February now that is because I will be editing a lot this is not because I am lazy or I need to take a break from you guys and um, much to the contrary I would rather have much more contact with you and I need to work on my personal habits uh, to achieve that as well as to work on the content itself so there will be a lot of off-screen work for me in these following months I am um, well, I don't want to spoil too much uh, but I would also like to throw some ideas uh, at you uh, for your consideration and perhaps a discussion in the comment section. So first of all, I really am bothered and uh, slightly frustrated with uh, the Let's Play format that I have tried quite a few times in great many, uh, well not great many, but a few different ways and it's never been really truly satisfying to me creatively, although it's a relatively low effort content editing wise so it's there is some satisfaction in that and it never really gathers that many views in my case at least now there is some consideration perhaps you know the classic standard let's play format is already a little bit stale for people because there's a lot of channels i would say that are running exclusively on let's plays that are just not faring as well as they used to and I think some sort of uh, comedy content, gaming comedy content, is more prevalent these days. Which doesn't necessarily mean I want to do just what is most prevalent these days. I actually am trying to, to reach some, uh, what would you say, compromise, something more in between. And that requires some experimentation with editing, with writing, with the delivery. And in the end, it will be more time consuming than a standard let's play. But I am thinking of something that could combine the storytelling nice sort of side of let's playing with perhaps a little bit more entertainment and a little bit more compact, abridged uh, 
structure of the storytelling so you don't really go one quest per episode or two quests per episode you don't really stretch everything you don't show the most if not all of your gameplay you just show the crucial bits with some roleplay story to it uh, basically and uh, that is easier said than done because making it interesting and uh, watchable may be a challenge now we will see how it goes but this is one of the things i want to try there are a few others i want to make some adjustments to the way i am making skyrim builds and fallout 4 builds and speaking of that i also would like to recreate remake some of my older builds that uh, were, were quite successful but maybe also some of the ones that weren't like the druid was I believe some somewhat less successful than expected, but it was also you know a very it didn't have the best quality when it comes to graphics and frame rate. So it, I will definitely would like to remake uh, the Druid, but I will also like to remake a few other uh, builds of old, like uh, the Mage Hunter, which I'm to this day quite proud of, and it's it's a it's a it's an interesting build, and I would love to see it slightly modded, not too much, because. Uh, part of the appeal of that Mage Hunter was that it was a vanilla build and achieved things that are not that easy to achieve in that game. So yes, yes, there will be some recreations and remaking in uh, the following months. And uh, what else is there to consider? Well, there are also some, some other games that I would like to try. Now, that is not really doing well in my case. So my Fallout 4 content isn't really going anywhere my sims 4 content is just non-existent there maybe maybe i need more patience i only made three videos uh, from sims 4 it's probably it would require like a lot more patience but i was a little bit spoiled by you spoiled by you guys back in the day when my uh, skyrim content just got rather satisfying views for the scale of my small uh, channel i would say uh, rather easily and rather <laughs> <laughs> rather speedily so um uh, i i probably you guys it's it's your fault you see you spoiled me and now i expect uh, all other content to do relatively well satisfyingly well and maybe that's just not an option maybe i need more patience in terms of other games or maybe i need another channel for other games because of course youtube algorithm morphs and mutates all the time and it really wants to truncate you into being basically you know uh, an, an unpaid marketing department for a single game which you know i like skyrim very much i don't really mind that much uh, in terms in case of skyrim to be condemned and forced to <laughs> quote and quote uh, quote and quote uh, forced to do it for the rest of my days but still for the sake of variety and personal creative let's say satisfaction it would be nice to be able to mix it up with some other games from time to time and i really would like to do that so uh, i think i will try a few more games i think i will try games uh, that are very retro in this following period this revamp period for my channel and uh, i will try to stay away from long series in terms of those other games and see just if anything lands for starters and then maybe commit to something uh, that landed well that would be uh, probably the best solution the best path forward <laughs> And I think that leaves me with only one more thing to talk about. One more talking point on my agenda is the non-gaming content. Now, I tried, I have tried um, in, uh, TV show reviews <laughs> uh, in 2022. And they were also moderately successful, again, for the scale of this channel. But still, it's it, it went somewhere, you know. It got some uh, discussion, some very interesting discussion at times. Uh, that I participated in personally with the viewers, some new viewers and new subscribers that would possibly be interested in having more of that. Now, uh, there was also a compilation of Mauler's. Uh, Mauler is a YouTube movie critic, so to say, which you may not be aware of, or maybe you are. 
uh, there was a compilation I made for uh, uh, and uploaded on the other channel that is at the time almost entirely dead. But that one video made some progress. It was like 20,000 views and uh, quite a lot of comments, you know, some subscribers from that. I got, I believe, a hundred subscribers from just that little silly compilation I made while being slightly tipsy on a New Year's Eve <laughs> last year, a year ago. Suddenly, algorithm brain farted in my favor and uh, decided to show it to quite a few people. And there was a more or less positive reaction. And there was a discussion. That's interesting to me. So I will try to also do something for that channel. And therefore, I think, even though it's not perhaps the most expedient option, it won't give me money, to put it bluntly, not very soon anyway. And I think to keep things more intelligible for the algorithm and for you guys, more cut clean cut and orderly i will start just uploading my future videos about well non-gaming videos my reviews and perhaps some other content over there at berizorus talks and that would be possibly something uh, some other branch finally years after i first thought about it uh, maybe finally there will be something there that is also a major reason to take a break because the, that type of content, the other type of content I would like to try myself in uh, is also quite time consuming and uh, uh, demanding. It demands some research, it demands some very proper editing at times at least. It demands a fair bit of just thinking through and formulating your arguments, uh, you know. Uh, because some of that may be a little bit divisive, <laughs> you know. Some of that may be unnecessarily, of course, in my humble opinion, but still may get politicized. And um, so, therefore, you need to be, you know, you can't really just throw for the first word that comes to your mind and you can't really just blather as I do now. You have to, um, you have to think. So, uh, that being said, it will take some time to really hone the formula and the ideas for the other type of content that is going to be uploaded on Belisaurus Talks. Now, I think, I believe that is all there is to say about all of that. So, to sum up, there will be new types of content on this channel and there will be new channel that will have some uploads, although I don't expect them to be very regular. But all of that requires uh, of me to have a little break where I just edit and prepare some content in advance because then I can just slowly and steadily release it to you guys while working on other stuff. Now, I think that's the best solution for the future and so I will take my little break. As I said, it's not, a it's not a, like a total break. It happened in this channel more than a few times and more times and I would like to admit that I would disappear for a month or two or more and then come back. Uh, this time, however, it is fully a fully controlled crisis of <laughs> upload, fully planned and hopefully executed uh, for the betterment of my content and your enjoyment. So all that is left, I guess, is to say thank you guys for your stalwart and never-ending support, for your, for your nice comments and also for your constructive criticism, which has indeed led me to some improvements the, uh, that last year, uh, I think and hope at least uh, that was the case. Uh, thank you for your uh, likes and comments and thank you for helping me and allowing me to do this. Uh, also quite grateful for a few tips uh, thrown in my tip jar uh, lately and uh, remember there is a subscribe star and I'm still on the fence with Patreon because on the other one hand it would be probably convenient to some people and on the other hand it's uh, uh, you know it's a rather horrible place in my humble estimation and what they have done in terms of overreaching and overstepping the boundaries of their own rules in the past is rather annoying but then 
can I fix it? I don't think I can fix it and maybe I should just finally go and do the Patreon thing. So I'm blathering again, I'm going on another tangent, uh, but yes, <laughs> thank you guys. Thank you guys very much for watching this and watching all my content, all the support and we will definitely see each other again, you know, building back better. <laughs> That was unnecessary. I said, look, it's fine. Whoever you voted for in the US, it's fine. I'm not from the US. I'm, it was just a joke. Chill out. <laughs>